Hi you guys, so I did my daughter's hair yesterday and I added lots of beads and braiding hair, but I really thought it was just too heavy for her hair. So today I'm just going to redo her hair with some lighter weight hair. Uh, this is like a Cuban kinky twist type of hair. And I will put the link in the description box on what type of hair it was. And then I'll be using my crochet to do the anchor method where you just take a little bit of the hair, crochet it through, and then you use another piece of hair and just put it around all of that hair and use that as the three legs and just start plaiting. And I promise I'm not doing it hard or like using a lot of tension on her scalp. She just hates getting her hair done and she doesn't like sitting for, you know, a while. But yeah, just thought I'd say that because, you know, she's crying and acting a fool, but it's very loose at her roots. <laughs> and so now I'm just showing you how I do the bobby pin beaded feet trick, however you want to say it. I need to take a bobby pin, put the hair onto it, and then put the beads in the bobby pin. And then you just slide the beads down. Sometimes it's going to be hard if the hair is still thick at the end. So it's best to get like pre-stretched hair or just braid all the way down. And then, you know, slide the beads up if the hair is too long and just cut. And then right here, I'm getting my rubber bands. Sometimes I take two. And then I just take the last bead and then fold the hair and just put the rubber band on top and keep you know, twisting the rubber band until it gets tight. And then you're gonna slide the rest of the beads down and then you want it to cut the excess hair.